Steve Cho. Why? Because I 
because I said I would be here. More importantly, I didn't want to disappoint you, but more, I didn't want to disappoint myself. I had more self-respect and I want people to say, you know, Kathy does what she says she's going to do. I have friends that are continuously late and that's their mojo. Oh, so-and-so, she'll be late. You know, we have to start without her. Or, you know, she'll blow it off because I heard, you know, she's going to meet a friend. She won't be here. You want people to say that about yourself. No, I'm sure you don't. If you're here in this room, you don't. I know I'm speaking to the choir here. <laughs> However, think about it's more than being a timer. Oh, I'm just supposed to be a timer. I won't come today. But you'll miss out on those listening skills practice. And you're also sending a bigger message about your character, who you are. It's not about just serving this timer, odd counter, speaker. You're sending the message of your character. And I invite you to think about that and consider it. I have had so much personal growth, so much more confidence, because I made a commitment. This is school for me. School's never out for the pro. You gotta be here. It, through over the years, I've come across so many relationships, quality people I would never have been exposed to had it not been for Toastmasters. My sphere of influence was little, but because of Toastmasters, it's great. Look at you, look at your fine people that I'm meeting here. I would not have had that without Toastmasters. So I challenge you to don't cheat yourself. Don't cheat yourself. Open yourself up to the opportunity. Opportunity favors the prepared mind.